Hey guys, uh, welcome to your uh, general reading, uh, what your blocks and challenges are for uh, Libra. Uh, this is going to be for your September 2022. You could apply this to any of your placements, okay? Because this reading could be about anything. Uh, we're just going to see what the cards have to say. We're going to take a look and see what your blocks and challenges are. And uh, we'll finish off the read to see how you can overcome them, transcend them, what to look out for, what you need to work on. Apply this to your own unique situation, okay? Keep in mind that these are general messages. Take what resonates and leave the rest behind. If this message didn't resonate with you, take a look at your other placements. If you guys haven't done so yet, hit the subscription button and the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post. Give this video a thumbs up. Like this video, share this video, leave a comment down in the comment section below if this message resonates. Keep in mind that these are collective messages for the collective um, Libra people not tapping into one specific per person's energies in particular. Uh, if you're looking for a reading specific to your unique situations and your energies, I suggest you book a private personal reading with me. Um, the link for that is in the description box below. Also, a quick note that this reading is not really meant to be cross-watched, uh, flipped, twisted, or reversed. Uh, this reading is more so for the Libra people that are currently in the path of healing, uh, personal growth, and spiritual growth. Um, but if you want to do so, you can feel free to do so, okay? So Libra, let's get started. Tell me about Libra here. What are Libra's current blocks and challenges for September 2022? What are Libra's current blocks and challenges for September 2022? What are Libra's current blocks and challenges? Eight of Cups in the reverse. I feel like you're having a hard time stepping away from something here, okay? I feel like you keep stepping away, going back to it, stepping away, going back to it. Could be anything. I mean, could be a bad job, okay? An ex, bad friends, family members, all right? Okay, we have the Nine of Pentacles here. We have Judgment, Sagittarius Energy. So Nine of Pentacles, Virgo Energy, Pre Empress energy here, Judgment, Sagittarius energy. We have the Knight of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sag. It seems like you're having a hard time making this a decision regarding your freedom and your independence here. So I feel like you're having a hard time maybe walking away from, you know, your family that has financially supported you. Okay, or that you, you're having a hard time walking away from a relationship because this partner has uh, financially supported you. Okay, uh, we have the page of wands here. I feel like someone here is yearning for their independence and their freedom, and I feel like someone here is having a hard time stepping away from this support that someone here has gotten for a very long time. Uh, page of wands, Aries, Leo, Sag. Ten of Wands here. Oh. I don't know. So, like I said, Libra, you could be dealing dealing with maybe you're dealing with someone that's like this. Okay, like I said, this message is really not really meant to be cross watch, flip, twisted, or reverse. But I feel like this could be someone that you know. Whoever this individual is, I feel like this person's a spoiled brat. Okay, because I feel like this person does not really want to stand on their own two feet, even though they want to, they don't. They feel like it's too hard. Okay, with the Ten of Wands here, they feel it's too overwhelming. So, I, 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 I like it, it could be a situation that this person, their parents pay for this person's apartment, their food, whatever it may be, this person's not really doing it on their own. Like, I feel like this person wants to do it, but like I said, I feel like this person feels like it's too hard. Whoever this is, this is an individual that is very immature, okay? This person runs from real life, I feel, okay? The Eight of Cups in the reverse. Page of Swords, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini, the Nine of Pentacles here, and the Queen of Wands. You know, this could be a situation that Libra, maybe you're the parent of this child, okay? Um, so like I said, apply this to your own unique situation. So Page of Swords, uh, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini, Queen of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sag. 
Judgment, Six of Wands, Knight of Wands, and the Two of Wands. I mean, you could have a decision. You could have a decision decision to make to cut this person out of your life, okay? Because you might be getting overwhelmed by this person, by giving so much to this person, okay? So it could be a realization that, you know, it's time for me to take care of myself. So that could be you. Maybe you're having a hard time walking away from this, okay? Uh, the nine, uh, the page of wands. Two of Swords, Ten of Wands, and the Ace of Cups. This is hard. Let's say if this is truly your child here, you know, I feel like you love this child so much, you're going to do everything that you can to help them. But, you know, I feel like this is at the expense of your happiness here or your freedom, okay? Ace of Cups here. Yeah, it just seems like there's an energy that you're ready to drop it. There's, there's an energy of feeling stuck, okay? And whoever this child is or whoever this person is, this person's feeling really arrogant too and cocky that they truly believe that you would never cut them off. This is a very specific reading, I feel, by the way. So, you know, I feel like it's maybe, maybe meant for one of you guys out there. Um... Tell me about Libra. How can they overcome their blocks and challenges? How can they overcome their blocks and challenges for September 2022? All right, the Hierophant, Taurus Energy, the Three of Cups, the Wheel of Fortune, the Tower. Oh, the universe is about to step in. All right, the moon and the hangman, okay. The, th the reason why that universe is stepping in this way, it's because, you know, this, you know, there's a bit of an imbalance with the energies. And I feel like the universe steps, when, when that happens, the universe steps in to balance it out. And I feel like it could be a huge tarot moment. Yeah, the Hierophant and the Three of Cups, Taurus energy. Uh, Wheel of Fortune in the Tower. Okay, Aries Scorpio. The Moon, Cancer Pisces, and the Hangman, Piscean Energy. So, I feel like you're having fear of letting go of this too. Yeah, the thing is I feel like... I feel like moving forward, I feel like you need to do the right thing for you, you know? I mean, maybe this is not one person, you know? Maybe you're helping out other people here too. The Hierophant, Ace of Wands, Three of Cups, and the Nine of Cups. And yeah, it seems like moving forward, you know, you want to surround yourself with the right people. You know, you want to find happiness here. You want to pursue your passions. Could be a situation that by dealing with the situation, by being in the situation, it's kept you from doing, th doing the things that you want to do. The Wheel of Fortune, Four of Cups, the Tower, Aries Scorpio, uh, uh, Air, uh, Emperor Aries Energy right here. Yeah, it seems like the universe is about to send you a huge, I, I would say a blessing in disguise. Yeah. Yeah, because I feel like as soon as this happens, I feel like things are going to sort of start falling into place, you know? Yeah, it could be a situation that some, like I said, I feel like someone here might be getting cut off. The, the moon, four pentacles, hangman. And the uh, Ten of Cups. I just feel like you're no, lo no longer holding on to your fear. I feel like you're surrendering a people here or somebody or a family member. Because I just feel like you're not happy. Yeah, I feel like you're ready to go heal. You're ready to move on from this. I just feel like you don't want to deal with this anymore because it's becoming a, becoming, becoming a burden, Libra. 
okay? So Libra, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Share this video, like this video if you haven't done so yet, subscribe, hit the notification bell. I'll speak to you guys in the next one. All right, thanks guys, bye.